This is eight, uh, SIT's 8 inch by 8 inch planar thicknesser designed for doing overhead surfacing and thicknessing underneath. Maximum capacity of 210mm across the table as well as a depth of 210mm again being the 8 inches. A good quality cast aluminium fence supports the work when surfacing and all the appropriate safety guards are in place at all times. The aluminium extrusion fence is easily adjusted from the 90 degree position through to 45 degrees with preset stops or anywhere in between, enabling chamfering or angling of edges of boards to be done with ease. The cutter block is powered by a two horsepower motor, driving the two knife block which features resharpenable knives, running at 1500 RPM. That should give a very good finish on all soft and hardwoods. The powerful two horsepower motor drives the twin cutter block or twin knife cutter block at 8500 RPM. The knives are resharpenable and at that speed will give a very good finish on both hard and softwoods or anything that you throw at it. The machine is currently disconnected from any power supply and you can see here the cutter block with the knives and these are easily removed using the allen key screws supplied and adjusted with the fine adjusters to get the blades in the optimum position. When surfacing, a maximum two millimetre depth of cut can be taken, as the same with thicknessing, and the tables are easily adjustable to achieve those dimensions. A very nice feature of this machine is it has inbuilt dust extraction, so you don't need a separate extractor with it. All the shavings will come through the machine and get collected in the chip collector bag at the side, ready for emptying once the job is finished. To convert from surfacing to thicknessing is quite a straightforward procedure. First of all, having disconnected it from the power, we slide out the bridge guard, release the fence tab, slide the fence forward, and then wind the table completely down using the wind. We can then release the two security tabs, which freeze the dust hood that sits underneath. Once you've slid the hood back over the top, just slide in the interlock switches to make sure this is running. We can bring the fence in just to lock it and it is now ready to do our thicknessing through from the underside.